What's up guys, so I'm going to show how to play a pickup truck by Kings of Leon and um, this is off their Come Around Sundown album and I got a request to do this song from Jess in New Jersey so here it is, I hope you enjoy it and um, it took me a while to figure it out actually I was trying to string a few different little chords to try and get the melody of it but I think I have it right so it's, uh, you can play along with it and sing along with it, it sounds grand with the song so I hope you hope you enjoy this lesson. It's actually not too bad. It's only two chords for the verse and the chorus. It doesn't really change. So you can play along with it yourselves when you learn this, and you'll see it. It does the job. Like so, um, any new people, please like and subscribe. I'll have lots more lessons to come, and there's a good bit on the channel already. So thanks for watching, guys. Here we go. So basically, it's in the C. It's in the C chord. So you're going to be, the two cards, just show you the two cards first, so you, the first card you're going to need is C, so you're going to be on the third fret of the A, second fret of the D, and first fret of the B, C card. C card, and then the second card you're going to need, it's like an F, it's like an F card, but it's not. <laughs> There's probably a name on it, but I don't know what it is. So here, look, I'll just show you. So C, and then the next one, it's very like C, but you're going to be on the third fret of the D with your ring finger, second fret of the G with your middle finger, and then first fret of the B with your index. So you're just these two fingers, you're going from here with the C, just down onto here. So that's the only change you're going to be doing in this song, that is that is it, but it's finger picking, so that's the bit that's going to take a bit of getting used to, so it's picked, like, right. sorry now. So the way you're going to be picking it is, Pick the low E, so say so you start on the C, you're going to pick the low or the A string, then the high E string, you're going to pick the D string, G string, B string. So A, high E, D, G, B. Then you're going to hit the A string again, then the high E string again. Then D, G, B. And when you get to there, you go back down. So you go G, B. So here's the whole lot. So it's A, high E, D, G, B. Then you hit the A again. High E, D, G, B, then back down, so D, or G, D, and then change, so that all together is And that leads into the next card and just a little tip for any new people that if you're finger picking right try keep your thumb away from your other finger so it's not hitting off them when you're picking right and use your thumb for the bottom three or the top three strings so low E A and D try use your thumb and for a high E use your ring finger For B, use your middle, sorry, B, and then for G, use your index. Alright, so that's a, that's a very, I think it's very important when you're finger picking that. It gives you free, when you get used to using them fingers for them strings, it'll free up your hand and you won't have problems. Right, so... 
I'll get back to the lesson. If you are getting confused or anything anywhere throughout this lesson, just rewind it back to where you were comfortable. I know, I always say it, but it does help, like, just go back to where you knew what was going on and go from there. So you're going to go C chord, A, high E, D, G, B, A, high E, D, G, B, G, D. So it's... Now you're going to go to that second chord I showed you and you're going to go D, high E, D, G, B, D, high E, D, G, B, so twice. D high E D G B D high E D G B and then back down so it goes G D and back to this chord so the whole thing It's tricky enough like it'll take a few tries to get it you know but it's it actually sounds good so it's it's worth doing you know see it's catching me there now but uh, yeah that's basically the way it's picked and all so just once you get the hang of that picking pattern and um, just keep trying it and you will get it and one thing about this if you're new to guitar and you're only learning the finger pick that picking pattern will improve your finger picking 100% so the chorus is strummed so you can strum the chorus uh, or you can pick it but strumming it just makes it more it separates it from the verse so strumming is probably better like so I'll just go into the chorus and show you the strumming pattern and it's easy as well, it's not too bad. Fuck. So here's the chorus. like that so strum pattern for that I'm doing is down 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 up up down down up down up change down 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 up up down down up down up down 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 up up down down up down up down 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 up up down down up down up that when you're finished that so that's that whole song that's the way it's going to keep going like just the best thing actually you know what? if you learn the picking pattern and you have the strumming down put on the song even put on the instrumental of it and play along with it play along with it yourself and you'll get it fairly quickly like. because it's the fact that it's just them two chords you're constantly cycling through them but you're going to improve your finger picking with that song and you're going to It'll improve your strumming. Anything improves you, you know. But I hope you've enjoyed that, guys. Please like and subscribe. And I'll pop a video of the pick with my right hand so you can see exactly what I'm doing. I'll do it nice and slow. Alright, so I'm just going to show an example of the picking.
Now the summer pattern. And that's the way she'll keep going guys, so thanks for watching.